these fake Disney bands steal the show. Welcome to Ms. Mojo, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 Disney bands we wish we could see in concert. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. For this list, we'll be looking at bands and artists from Disney movies, Disney Channel shows, and Disney Channel original movies. Number 10. Lemonade Mouth, Lemonade Mouth Poets, geniuses, revolutionaries. That's what they call Lemonade Mouth. One fateful day in detention, five kids went from strangers to friends to bandmates. One of the best things about this band is that they weren't a perfect team from the beginning. We got to see them learn and grow together and become so much more than just a band. They have a wide musical range, spanning many different genres from pop to rock, with some rap mixed in. And while their songs are serious toe-tappers, they're more than just entertainment. Lemonade Mouth uses their music to speak their voice and protest injustice at their school. Number 9. Boys in Motion, That's So Raven. Clearly inspired by NSYNC, the Backstreet Boys, and similar musical groups, these guys are the swoon-worthy boy band that all the high school girls, and pretty much everyone else, are crazy about. Even Raven's mom is obsessed with them. Bye, 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 home cooking! And in spite of their stardom, they actually turn out to be pretty nice. They perform at Raven's school as a favor, and even invite her, Eddie, and Chelsea on stage with them. Come on, everybody, try to make some noise with the boys. They might only have a handful of songs and that disaster safety video, but they'll still leave you wanting more. I'm going through a tunnel. Number 8. Oh Boys, Kim Possible. Similar to Boys in Motion, the Oh Boys are another boy band obviously inspired by real-life 90s and early 2000s groups. With lyrics like, quit playing games with my head, and I want it my way. Their songs are a bit derivative, but still good fun. I just want it my way, cause I want it my way, I, I like it my way. Once beloved far and wide, these pop star divas are long past their time in the spotlight. But don't worry, they still have fans in the likes of the Senior Seniors. Quit playing games with my head. I'm a sport, but I'm not a toy. After being kidnapped by the evil father-son duo, the band recaptures that old magic and uses their sick dance moves to escape their prison. Number 7. The Cheetah Girls the Cheetah Girls franchise. When I was just a little girl, my mama used to took me into bed. This group was so popular, they actually did make the jump from the screen to performing in real life. The Cheetah Girls are four friends who struggle with fame and fortune as they rise through the ranks in the music industry. Egos get in the way, and contracts cause friction. But in the end, they stay best friends. After the success of their first film, this empowering girl group gave us two sequels, three soundtracks, three studio albums, and three tours. But sadly, they broke up in late 2008. How awesome would it be to see this group reunite on the stage for one more tour? Amigas, you snuck your way right into my heart. Truly, that was an evening I will never, ever forget. Number 6. Love Handle, Phineas and Ferb Despite the classical music-inspired name, Love Handle is actually a once-famous 80s glam rock band. When their dad forgets about his wedding anniversary, 
Phineas and Ferb help him make it up to their mom by reuniting their parents' favorite band for one last show. Fell asleep in a metronome factory. When I awoke, I completely lost my sense of rhythm. I've been hanging out here ever since. Though they broke up years ago, Love Handle still clearly has the music in them, and they perform one rockin' concert, making the parents fall in love all over again. Just like Danny the guitarist says, music has the power to change your life. Music has the power to change your life. Wild outfits and that powerful music for more than one night only. Number 5. Loretta Modern and the Zeta Bites, Pixel Perfect. My mind is racing at the speed of light. Forget an auto tuned lead singer, Loretta Modern is 100% all digital. Led by a holographic front woman, the Zeta Bites are an unknown local band, trying to make their way up in the industry. If I cut my hair, if I change my clothes, will you notice me? Though they do suffer through a bit of a power struggle, they eventually begin to gain stardom. The combination of Sam's vulnerable and introspective songs with Loretta's superhuman dance moves makes them one of Disney's best fictional bands. They definitely have us wanting to rock out in real life to their unreal performances. Number 4. The Twitty Stevens Connection – Even Stevens First, there was the Alan Twitty Project, but when Wren was invited into the band, Lewis left to start the Lewis Stevens Experience. The bunny in my brain goes hip hop, hip hop. After a series of disastrous mishaps, where both bands competed against each other for a gig at a popular party, they were eventually able to put their differences aside. Wren and Lewis almost always disagree, which makes it that much more heartwarming when the two of them share the stage in the Twitty Stevens Connection. We all wish we were in attendance on the day they rocked that rooftop concert with the song they wrote together. I just close my eyes and say Another perfect day. Number 3. Pink Slip – Freaky Friday yeah. This band, led by Lindsay Lohan and Christina Vidal, seriously rocks. They rock so hard, in fact, that their song Take Me Away earned them a coveted regular gig at the House of Blues. Their catchy hooks and well-written lyrics definitely make them a great fake band. Don't you just wish you could hire them to play their toe-tapping, head-banging hard rock tunes at your wedding? You're the kind of friend who always spends when I'm broken like an Oh, and seeing Jamie Lee Curtis shredding a sick guitar solo would be pretty awesome too. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Number 2. Protozoa – Xenon Franchise This band is the pop sensation of the future, where apparently spiky dyed hair and flashy outfits have not gone out of style. Protozoa's cosmic theme songs will have you singing and dancing along no matter what planet you're from, and they are just fun to watch. Featuring in all three Xenon movies, Protozoa provides the soundtrack to the adventurous lives of Xenon and her friends, as they play jams that are out of this world. Unfortunately for now, they only exist in the Disney Channel movie, but maybe in the future, we'll get the real deal. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Hey now, hey now, this is what dreams are made of. Those days are gone, I know. The world that won't stop spinning, so I take control. Number one, Powerline. A goofy movie. Got myself a notion. Don't lie, you know you tried to do the perfect cast as a kid. Hey, Dad! Dad! Do the perfect cast! Many songs from fictional bands or pop stars end up being very cliche or overproduced. But Powerline songs were genuinely great. They were catchy, with well written lyrics 
powerful themes and dynamic music. And Powerline himself had all the flair and charisma of a true pop star. No wonder all the kids were dying to see his show. Of course, it probably helped that his songs were performed by real-life 90s singer Tevin Campbell. And Campbell actually performed a song live at the movie's 20-year anniversary reunion. If only we could bear witness to Powerline's real-life awesomeness, eye to eye. you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from Ms. Mojo and subscribe for new videos every day.